Hi everyone, I spent $145 on my Aldi trip this week. Um, we didn't need too much produce because my sister-in-law brought some veggies over from her garden, so we're going to try to eat those up this week. So we just got a little bit of, well, you'll see. We had grabbed two 2% 2 milks, two half and halves, five yogurts for Gabe's lunches. Looks like two raspberry, two strawberry, and a strawberry banana. We got three things of eggs completely out, and we're just stocking up. Uh, some American slices, some cream cheese, some uh, grape tomatoes, there we go, <laughs> some sharp cheddar, two bags of celery. My kids like to snack on this. A bag of oranges for my smoothies, and I realized when I got in the car that I forgot the bananas, dang it. <laughs> A uh, watermelon, a Josephine, <laughs> a cantaloupe. Did we get you at Aldi? No, you don't think so? <laughs> uh, a bag of chicken breasts. We got a bag of sweet peas. Two bags of the garden salad. And this is a splurge. This is a large chuck roast. It was, let's see how much. It was 360, oh, it was 3.63 pounds and it was 4.49 a pound at $16.30. Um, I'm going to cut this in half and get two dinners out of this. That is definitely a splurge for us, but I've been craving beef tips. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut them up and make a couple of beef tip dinners with it. And then some seasoned French fried potatoes. Some pizza snacks, two of those, two packages of Jumbo Franks, and some honey smoked ham. I just realized I completely skipped over the crescent rolls. I got two of those and a pineapple that needs to be cut up immediately. <laughs> There's that crazy Josephine again. Hey! Squish your head. Squish your head. <laughs> okay, so I got this citrus twist for a recipe um it actually goes in my beef tips recipe but i only need a can's worth and i don't know how much it was i'm gonna look it up i'll put it on the screen for you guys because i don't know if that was a good deal or not um some cherry mixed fruit for gabe's lunches as well as some pineapple tidbits two peanut butters as uh, some of the willow facial tissues some thick and chunky medium salsa four cans of the chunk white tuna in water a can of cream of mushroom soup some peanut butter uh, cookies. I gotta let my sweet tooth get the butter in me. Some Boulder um, kitchen garbage bags. Um, love those. Some Ritz type crackers. Love those. Some onion soup mix. Most of this processed stuff, you guys, this, the onion soup mix, the cream of mushroom soup, and the twist. <laughs> That's all for one recipe. Um, the pure vegetable, a pure vegetable oil, a bag of sugar, and for chips this week we decided to just get the sampler of the bags um, of the pre-portion size bags because I think it's going to help overall with my kids' portion control and not letting them sit down and have a whole bag of chips. Yes, it'd probably be cheaper if I went and bought the bags, but right now I don't have that kind of time, so this is the way we're doing it. And that was actually my husband's idea. <laughs> Three boxes of the Honey Nut Crispy Oats. Four loaves of Italian bread. Some the tortilla chips. Gabe wanted French roast this week. I got donut store blend. I still have a ton of the other coffee, but I like to just mix this in with it once I get down to like three quarters of it. And it's, I don't know, it just tastes better. And then I missed this in the cold supply or the cold part of the haul. And this is the vegetable mini egg rolls. And then over here, I got two packages of the boys L and D um, no show socks. These are going to be for Michael for school. I bought these um, in the girl version last fall for Madeline and I was really happy with the quality. They outlasted all the other socks that I got my kids. So I got grabbed Michael two packages of those for school. And over here I got myself some of the thick and quilted baby wipes. These are new at Aldi and I use baby wipes to take off my eye makeup. I have extremely sensitive skin so I thought I'd give these a try. On the menu this week we left 
tomorrow open tomorrow Saturday for me um, because Gabe and I have plans and I think we've decided that we're just gonna have the kids have chips and sandwiches on both Saturday and Sunday or maybe I'll just make breakfast on Sunday I can do that sounds delicious Monday we're going to have chicken and dumplings Tuesday is chicken fried rice and egg rolls Wednesday is wiener boats and french fries and Thursday is crock pot beef chips and mushrooms and that's the <laughs> Um, recipe that uses all the processed food but it's delicious so and super easy then Friday we're going to have pizza that's date night thank you guys so much for watching have a great day bye bye